Good morning and welcome to The Buzz. My name is Davis. And I'm Kenley. We will be your host this morning. Please join us for a moment of silence. Please stand for the pledge to the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our student-friendly mission statement. Today is Friday, January 13th, and we are on a day three rotation. For lunch today, we will be having pizza or corn dogs and salad. We want to wish a horn happy birthday to Braden Dimmick and Connor Monroe. Have a great birthday. Remember, there is no school on Monday. We will be out to celebrate Martin Luther King Jr. Watch this video to learn more about why he is celebrated. Once upon a time, there's a man named Martin Luther King Jr. It's funny to think about because now we know his name so well, but at one time he was just a kid. Like maybe you're a kid watching this. Well, he was a kid too. Well, maybe you're a grown up. That's okay too. Former kids are welcome here. I don't discriminate. Martin Luther King grew up to be a great man, of course, but things weren't all that great in the world while he was growing up. Not everybody was treated like they were somebody. And I believe that you should treat everybody like it's their birthday, but they didn't do that. People looked at the color of their skin, and that's how they decided if they were friends or not. Not cool, man. That didn't make him feel good. That didn't make anybody feel good. But his parents helped him grow up. He went to church. He learned about love. He grew up to be a minister to help a lot of people. He did all sorts of cool stuff. He helped a lot of people learn about love, too. But still, he looked around and said, things should be better. He wanted to change things, so he did stuff. He decided, instead of spreading the hate, he would spread the love. He wanted to bring people together. Where people were hurting, he stepped in to help. He marched with them, he walked with them. He walked arm in arm with everyone. Sometimes it didn't go well, but he kept going. Sometimes he ended up in prison, but he kept going. Some people didn't like him, but he kept going. Some days were hard, but he kept going. Love does that, it just keeps going, even when things are dark. And, well, I don't like this part of the story, but things did get pretty dark. Someone who didn't agree with him, shot him. He died in April 1968. Now keep, keep, keep pressing it. Why are you telling us this sad story? Come on. I know, I know. I'm sorry, but it happened. I don't like that happened. Now I gotta tell you something. When things aren't awesome, it can be tough. And things will always be awesome. But your response can be. Martin Luther King's response? It was awesome. Today I just wanted us to think about this. Isn't it cool that we can change things? Like any of us, anybody. He dreamed and he changed things, and he dreamed and he kept sharing his dreams. They became not just his dream, a lot of people's dream. Like this one. I have a dream that little black boys and black girls will join hands with white boys and white girls and become sister and brothers. That's a pretty good dream. Let's dream like that. That could change things. And now it's time for the joke of the day. What is a black cat's favorite color? I don't know, what is a black cat's favorite color? Purple. Thanks and have a great day.